Hello and welcome to another video by ATC. Airplanes are always fascinating. Humans were never meant to fly, but these are the giant machines which made impossible possible. How many of you have wondered about the type or kind of the aircraft that you are traveling in or the aircrafts flying over you in the sky? Is it a Boeing or an Airbus? Is it A320 or a Boeing 737? The very obvious and the easiest way out is look for the name on the aircraft fuselage. Most airlines. Whoa! Wait a minute! I don't know who put it in there. <laughs> Anyways. We were discussing that identifying airplanes should be easy if you are closer to the aircraft park on the apron of course. The major difference lies inside the cockpits of the aircrafts but we can't always see the cockpits. Especially when we are standing on the ground and airplane is flying over us. Can be. Today in this video we will focus on two giants of aviation Airbus and Boeing. It means no takeoff clearance for ATR, McDonnell Douglas, Antonov, Illusion, Bombardier, Embraer, etc. in this comparison. So let's find out how can we identify the two major airliners just by external appearance in general. So let's begin A team and B team. The nose. This is the well known identity. Check out the noses. Airbus will have bulbous curved nose while Boeing will have more pointed nose. Have you ever noticed? Of course, many of you must have. Let's move on to second identity, that is windows. Check out the cockpit windows. Most Airbus cockpit side windows run in a straight line along the bottom, and most Boeing side windows run in a V shape along the bottom. Also, Airbus aircraft cockpit side windows look like one of their corners have been cut. Next is APU area. Have a look at the APU exhaust at the tail. Airbuses generally have circular tail cone and Boeings generally have a tapered outlet. Next is fuselage or body. Fuselage cross section is also an easy bet. Airbuses have an almost perfectly circular cross section while Boeings are more oblong. Now comes number of engines. I don't think it is required to explain about these two beauties. Still for the others who are newbies, if it has two deck of windows and four engines, it is an A380 and if it has one and half decks and four engines it is a Boeing 747. Only A340s, A380s and Boeing 747s have four engines. All other aircrafts are twin engines. If you see an aircraft with single deck, longer fuselage and four engines, it is an A340. Now let's see what wheels have to do with identification. These are the wheel prints of the aircrafts like you have thumbprints. So for example, for identification, if you see an aircraft with two pairs of main wheels and one pair of nose wheel, then it's either Airbus A318, 19, 20, 21 or it's a Boeing 737. Similarly, you may use this wheel print chart for identification purposes. Check out the three pairs of wheels on each main landing gear of Boeing 777. Here's an extra info. A Boeing 777 will never have a winglet, with an exception. If you know what I mean, then comment down below your replies. Moving on. The Boeing 777 has 14 wheels in a 662 configuration. Great tip to identify is, in Boeing 777, 37s have 3 wheels. This is Airbus A330 with 2 pair of wheels on each main landing gear. Moving on. The vertical pin. Note how the tail fin of the Boeing 737 rises from the main body at a sharp angle. Boeing 737 has a dorsal fin, while Airbus doesn't have a dorsal fin. Horizontal Stabilizers The horizontal stabilizers as well as the vertical fin, together also known as empennage, are located much closer to the fuselage end in Boeing compared to Airbus. Everything we discussed till now was about daytime when we are able to see the aircraft in light. But what about identifying airplane at night? Strobe lights. Yes, the strobe lights are much more than just blinking lights on the wingtip and the tail. These can help you identifying the type of aircraft at night. Strobe lights in most airbus blinks twice a second 
and on the other hand in Boeing, strobe lights blink once per second. So by now, I hope you can now easily identify these flying birds in front of your friends and impress them by your sharp eyesight. And after you are done impressing your friends, share this video with them too so that they could impress their friends as well. So now I will go to my terrace and stalk airplanes and will try to- Hey, what the flying machine is that?